Welcome to BMW's latest entry-level sports coupe, the 230i. This slots in below the M240i and above the 220i. On first impressions, the driving character and interior size kind of reminds us of BMWs from the good old days, like the E36. This example we're testing here features the full M Sport pack, which is standard in Australia. Paired with the lovely M Portimao blue paint finish, which is a throwback to the old Estoril blue, we think this is a great looking package. However, there are some details we're not quite convinced on, such as these pokey little tail lights. We love the grey lower skirting though, and the rear haunches that swell out for a muscular stance. Unlike the new M240i, the 230i is rear wheel drive, so you get BMW's traditional driving dynamics. There's also a set of 19 inch two-tone alloy wheels, wearing staggered tyre sizes front and rear, with 225 40s on the front, and wider 255 35s on the back. The pearly P0 tyres offer heaps of grip. This example also features red painted brake calipers, which is a no cost option. Inside, you get an ergonomic and sporty cabin that's presented with just the right amount of technology, we reckon. There are still plenty of physical buttons and a dashboard and center console that places a high importance on the driver, but yet there is plenty of depth to the infotainment system. We've started to notice new model BMWs, especially at the entry end of the showroom, appear to be losing the iDrive hand controller on the console, such as on the latest X1. This is really disappointing in our opinion, as the controller is a lot less distracting than playing around on a touchscreen, in our view anyway. Passenger space is decent for this type of car. It actually feels really cozy, but quite open and airy at the same time. The front sport seats cradle you in perfectly, and the rear seats even come with cup holders and climate vents. Obviously rear legroom is restricted, as per the standard for this segment. Boot space is measured at 390 litres, which is the same as the previous model. It's a good size, matching a lot of popular hot hatches on the market at the moment. You can also fold down the rear seats for extra length if you need it. The 230i receives the latest 2 litre turbo petrol 4 cylinder engine from BMW, as seen in the 330i and so on. With 190 kilowatts and 400 newton meters, it is a very gutsy unit for a little coupe like this, and it comes matched with the flawless ZF 8 speed auto. Unfortunately, there's no more manual. Out on the road, it is immediately clear this is a wonderful little driver's machine. It loves corners, and the steering is very inviting. But most surprising of all, the suspension is very compliant and forgiving. BMW must have completely overhauled its suspension philosophy in recent times, because this is not overly firm, which was a common criticism of previous M Sport setups. And this doesn't even feature adaptive dampers. Performance is outstanding, Really, for a regular, non-M model, it's excitingly fast. The soundtrack isn't too bad either. This is what it goes like. 